Oscar Peterson was one of the most brilliant pianists and composers in the history of music, as well as a respected mentor and educator. The Oscar Peterson 2022 commemorative coin celebrates a Canadian changemaker who had a loud and echoing influence. The coin honors Oscar's love of music and his lasting legacy, and is a symbolic standing ovation for a Canadian legend who helped shape the Canada we know and love today. Dave Young is a multiple award-winning bassist and composer. For 35 years, he played alongside Oscar Peterson, who praised his sense of time. Eventually, touring around the world led to a friendship far beyond music. And Robbie Botosh has been hailed as one of the most diverse multi-instrumentalists of this generation. He has a keen ability for perfecting his idol's technique, like Oscar Peterson. I'm in Toronto to meet with the both of them and discuss Oscar Peterson's impact. Do you think that he ever learned anything from, from all those years with you? From you? <laughs> well, um, I think maybe what he learns when he takes a chance on people is, yeah, I was right. I was right. I knew that this guy has something in him that, that I was tapping into, it, and I knew that I could cultivate a, a, a better response. And I think he took a chance on me when he, when he said, you want to play in my band? Right. Uh, and I said, yes, you know. And oddly enough, that very first engagement was in 1975, and the question was, do you want to join the Oscar Peterson group? And I said, yes. The first thing up will be a three-week tour of Japan. I said, by the way, who's in the Oscar Peterson group? I'm really looking forward to it. And they said, well, there's you, and there's Oscar. It's a duo. <laughs> there's just two of you. I said, what? <laughs> How would you describe him as a musician? Uh, I think Oscar was kind of a unique combination of a very high intellect and a, a huge range of interest coupled with a fantastic musical, just natural sense. He had a natural sense about music and, and how to play. and He didn't spend a lot of time studying it in music school. And as a matter of fact, I don't think he spent any time in music school. So when he created an arrangement, it worked. For me, for my generation growing up on Oscar Peterson's music, it's like like the, the, the level of, of, yes, everybody talks about the speed and the, the, the chops, but the feel and the swing it's equally it's up there. Up there's no, there. there's no, you know, some players, they play, but they couldn't do that technically. There's a certain mastery you have of uh, Oscar Peterson's style. Like, what is the hardest thing about that? The hardest thing about that is to play it with honesty. I had the, the greatest honor of opening for him. Right. For me, it was like, you know, a, a, really a walking legend. And one of the first things he said, you know, because I played some Eastern European vibes and some Hungarian stuff and mm -hmm. some got into, like I, I, like halfway, I'm like, I gotta do my thing. <laughs> you know, cause like it messes with you when yeah. someone like that He's is looking. listening. And he says, I, I love what you're doing and keep it up. I really enjoy hearing those things. But he wouldn't point out what, and I, and I said, oh, thank you. He's like, no, keep doing what you're doing. Uh, and he kept saying it, you know, like, right. I love that stuff, and I think you need to open that up and keep, keep. And this was just the best advice, because I could sit there and play the licks, and if he was alive, he would probably walk out of the room. Tell us about the song that you decided to play for us. It is um, a composition of his that he wrote for a bass player who worked for, for him for a long time, Niels Pedersen. Uh, and I, I think at that point, Niels decided to leave the group. So Oscar said, oh, I'll, you know. And so he, he, wrote, he wrote this song for him called, called Goodbye, Old Friend. 
now it's kind of changed. I, I basically play that song with him in mind. Right. You know, both Niels and Roscoe are gone, but uh, when I play the song, I kind of dedicate it to him. You know, because it, it's appropriately named Goodbye Old Friend, and it's perfect. So right. I, I think of him a lot, yeah. Is there anything that you you would like to tell him at this point in time? To any question that, that you would like to ask him, or, or one last thing that you could say to him? <laughs> Well, I, I was certainly, uh, you know, since his passing, I've played a lot of concerts in tribute to, to, to Oscar and his music, you know, with various groups. And I would probably say to him, OP, the music's in good hands, you know. We're, we're taking care of business. <laughs> and, and don't worry, you know, we're playing your music the way it should be played. And I think he'd be quite happy to hear that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>